we thank you this morning for sending your son, Jesus. We thank you this morning, Lord, that uh, you died upon the cross of Calvary and you paved the road for our salvation. Thank you this morning, Lord, for the experience that we have had of knowing you. The experience that we have in our life of knowing that you are part of our life, that you have called us by name, that you have called us personally, and you have personally saved us. And so, Lord, we thank you and we just pray that each day, Lord, as we uh, travel this journey on earth, that you will be a source of strength and guidance and may we always know and recognize your presence. But, Lord, for the one that maybe uh, is still on that road to salvation, for the one that you are speaking to, that you are calling, but they have not yet responded. We just pray, O oh Lord, that your spirit will remain, that you will continue to convict them, that you will continue to open their eyes and open their ears, that they uh, see you and that they know you. And we just pray, O oh Lord, that at the end, that their life will have a new direction, and that they will make the decision to accept you as their Lord and Savior. Thank you for those these moments, for those of us uh, who have gathered here, who have concerns upon our hearts, uh, for our brother who, who kneels. We just pray, O oh Lord, that you would indeed uh, uh, minister to each of us. You know our every thought, you know our every concern. And Lord, as we sing sometimes the chorus, I must tell Jesus, I must tell Jesus. And so, Lord, we, we, may we always seek you. May we always uh, look to you, Lord, for guidance and strength, no matter what the situations or circumstances may be in our life. Continue now, Lord, to uh, bless us with your presence as we continue to worship you in these moments. We ask this in the precious name of Jesus. Amen.